Hello guys, welcome again. As you all know, Christmas is coming in a few days. So, for today, I will show you how to model a, a Christmas gift box. And that is actually very easy and simple to do. So, I have in here my default cube and I'm gonna tab into edit mode. Okay and I'm gonna select the top vertices, make sure you select all the four vertices and I'm gonna shift duplicate them and grab them up on the Z axis just a little bit. Now scale them out to something like that and extrude them down on the Z axis. As you can see pretty much this is the box and I'm gonna tab into edit mode again again select the top vertices duplicate them and this time I'm gonna scale them on the down on the Y axis till about something like that and I'm gonna add a loop cut right in the middle and I'm gonna delete these two vertices in here and to make it simple I'm just gonna select uh, this new object press L uh, press P sorry and separate separate by selection now I'm gonna go into the new created object and I'm gonna add first a mirror modifier okay on this axis that's fine select clipping for now and I'm gonna start to model this okay extrude this down uh, down on the Z axis till about there extrude again on the Z axis you could just control shift tab and select the snap type to be vertex and you can snap this right there extrude again on the Z axis till they meet at the middle and I'm gonna grab this and take it there okay something like that and now I'm gonna grab these ones and I will I will deselect clipping and I'm gonna start extruding them as you can see something like this to make it kind of curved yeah that's fine and now just uh, make a phase between these ones in here okay I'm gonna select the this thing in here and okay first I just need to select these two vertices and shift S cursor to select it now I'm gonna select this and I'll just rotate it okay first press period and rotate around the cursor something like that okay a little bit of modeling in here and that that looks fine okay now I'm gonna do the next one okay uh, I'm just gonna grab these two again and I'm gonna extrude I need to make move this okay extrude again and again and again <coughs> and make it look nice
All right, again, I'm going to select these right in there and I'm going to make a face between them. And now I can come, to, uh, come back to my mesh and start editing to look nice. Okay, so it's something like that. That's really simple and basic. Okay, I think that I'm gonna do it here. I'm gonna duplicate this uh, object in there and I rotate 90 degrees on the Z axis. All right, now I'm gonna tap into edit mode, press 3, and uh, no, L doesn't work. I'm gonna select these vertices and delete them. Alright, also I'll enable clipping. And perhaps I'll just remove the doubles. Okay, I had no doubles in there. Okay, now I'll just add the modifiers. First I select the box and add the sub, uh, subdivision surface modifier. Now I'm gonna tap into edit mode and add some loop cuts in here to make it and look nice. One right here, another one on the top, All right there, right there, and maybe some other ones in here. Okay, do the same for the top part of the box. In there. Okay. And this looks nicer. You see the edges are round now. I can select the smooth shading. Perfect edges. Uh, a number of subdivisions of two is okay. You can select op optimal display as well. And we're gonna do the same thing for this object. First I select the smooth shading. shading and I will add a subdivision surface modifier. I'll tab into edit mode and I'll just enable this to see it better. Okay, I just need a loop cut in here, another one in here, one in there, in there, and here. Alright, that, that looks fine. And another subdivision surface for this object in here. Again, I'm gonna tab into edit mode and I'm gonna add some loop cuts right in here. Another one in here. And one in here. Okay, so as you can see, pretty much this is a Christmas gift box. It's really easy to do. Takes like five minutes or yeah, ten minutes <laughs> to model it. Looks nice. You could add now some uh, some materials to it and make it look real, really nice. Okay, so thank you for watching. I hope you all guys, all of you guys have a happy Christmas and a happy new year and Merry Christmas guys.